kitchen again. Today I'm going to show you how to make banana bread. It's a recipe that I took from online and modified it to my own personal liking. There's less sugar, there's more whole wheat flour used, in fact, the other one didn't call for whole wheat flour at all. So I added whole wheat flour. And there are a few other minor changes that I made to make it just a little bit healthier and taste a little bit better. So I guess you could call this my own personal recipe. And so I just going to go and get started. First thing you need to do is set your oven to 350 degrees. Next you'll need to prep your pans. I like to do this in the sink because the baker's joy kind of gets everywhere. Your next step is to peel your bananas and mash them up. You'll mash the bananas till they're about the consistency of applesauce. So you see here they're kind of like applesauce. Next, you're going to take your one quarter cup of evaporated milk. And you're going to add about a teaspoon of lemon juice. Let that mix. Then you're going to add in your one and a third teaspoons of lemon juice. I mean, I'm sorry, not lemon juice, of uh, baking soda. You should see it start to rise as the acid of the lemon juice reacts with the base of the baking soda. You see how it was much more shallow earlier, but now it seems to be creeping up the sides. It's exactly what you need. This will help your bread rise. At this point, you're just going to add the rest of the ingredients. and then mix all your ingredients. Do this by hand, don't use a mixer. Then you'll get over mixing. After the mixing, after you mix it long enough that all the ingredients have gotten wet and mixed properly, you're going to add your nuts. In this case, I chose pecans. You can choose walnuts or almonds or whatever it is that you prefer. And you need about one cup of those. After everything is well blended, you'll pour it into your pan. Then you'll just stick them in the oven. It'll take about one hour for the loaf. And you just leave them in there until the toothpick comes out almost clean. After about 25 minutes to half an hour, check 
the muffin pan because it tends to cook faster than the loaf. Check your loaf about 40 minutes into baking.